You know, Thanksgiving is all about bringing everyone to the table, generations sitting down together to give thanks for family, food, and blessings in our lives. But it doesn't have to look like a Norman Rockwell painting. The important thing is to be together and make the meal accessible for all. That means for the vegans, the gluten-free, lactose intolerant, those with other dietary issues, and little picky eaters too. In today's winning plate, we're bringing family together to show you how it can be done. Nutrition consultant Leslie Bonsi is here with her sweet little grand daughter Maya and you are doing something I bet you don't give advice to most people. You You're know starting what? with sugar here. I'm telling you, is whatever it takes, <laughs> right? And, and honestly, when we think about the Thanksgiving meal, some people really like the turkey and the Brussels sprouts. Others are going right to that end of the, the pie. meal. You <laughs> right. know, I mean, seriously, it's like whatever it takes. This is why it's an enabled table, inclusive for everyone. Well, and plus, you're grandma, so you get to spoil the kids, right? You don't have to stick to your own rules for the kids. That's right. right. There's different rules for them. Right. Of course, Absolutely. there's different rules for them. Here, you um, have a little more? Yeah. More, more sugar. More. Look, 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 sugar. Sugar. Okay. 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 Sugar okay. crash. Okay. Sugar crash. Okay. Okay. That's okay. So, so, should we talk about what we have here? Do you want to talk? Do you want to help us? Okay. 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 <laughs> well, so let's talk because you do have a lot of people with various uh, food issues now, and some people choose to be vegan or vegetarian. So, how do you please everyone? Yeah. And so, first of all, then we have a traditional plate. So we've got mm, turkey on so the plate. Good. But look at all those other wonderful things that are there. There's mashed potatoes. There's stuffing. There's vegetables that are there. But what if somebody's vegan? So instead of I won't have anything on the plate, we swap out the turkey, and this is actually a squash. And look oh. how gorgeous that squash is with green beans. This is actually a pear apple salad with the Brussels sprouts, sweet potatoes, and cranberries. You don't feel deprived at all. Right? Well, and we actually had somebody on uh, the other day who said, you know, he, he went through this phase where he was a vegetarian, and people would often try to appease him by making something that wasn't really good because that you just wanted to fill his need or fulfill his, his need, but just a simple addition like some extra vegetables will help. Exactly. And this is the carb lover's plate. You know, some that's, people say, I don't me. want anything else. That's there me. it is. We've got that's potatoes, me. we've got stuffing, we've got two potatoes, and we've works. got a little bit of fruit there. <laughs> and so what? If it makes you happy to do that, then do it. That's right? great. And, you know, this issue of cutting up, this is not just for little ones, but if you have older people in your family that simply cannot cut up food by themselves, what difference does it make if you do it for them? Right. Make it appropriate, make it easy, make it enabled. That's what we're talking about. Well, and this is such a fun plate to get. Did you have this already for your grandkids? Yes, of course. Oh, of course And look did. how fun this is. And this actually just sticks on the table so it won't fly oh, anywhere. But good. I'm telling you, for older people, that's not necessarily a bad thing either, just to make it easier. Yeah. Sometimes they get a little ornery. Yes. You know, and they we all things. get ornery. <laughs> we right. all get, ooh, and look at yeah. Okay, so tell me what Wow, wait, this is actually a little pumpkin tart. So, you know, by the time you've eaten this enormous meal and you say, oh, look, there's a whole pie, I better shove it in. We might not have to, is a little bit of something won't make you feel overstuffed right. and it still feels indulgent. And if we have vegans, this is actually a vegan cheesecake. But look how beautiful that it looks. Is. So everybody can eat something so at this, the table. This is in a plastic bowl. It looks like a uh, single serving. So you, did you just buy this at the grocery store? Yes, just and like you that. can just have it as it is. Or if people want to bake, it's not me, but if you want to bake, it's already done. And then a little variation on a theme of a little <laughs> pumpkin with a little bit of icing in the middle. Yum, 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 yum. No, you're not going to do it, are oh, you? Oh, <laughs> and what else do we have? And just for something very nice as we bring a pomegranate to the table because it's fun to share and it's fun to eat and sometimes we just want to nibble on or, it. Or lick the side of the pomegranate. Or just lick the side <laughs> of it as well. So what do you do for the picky eaters? Because that's where we have problems in our house. I know a lot of uh, people who are serving this Thanksgiving, they may not know what to do for the little kids. Exactly. And first of all, is this is not the time to try something new. It's also, if they want to run around, let them run around. If they just want to have a little bite off of somebody's plate, let them do it, it is fine. If they want to have a meal of Cheerios when everybody else is having turkey, fine. Why, fr why, you know, why stress? Right. Just enjoy it all. And if they don't want to eat anything, we could always do a felt table or just little wooden toys and just have fun so that everybody gets to be together and drop the pomegranates on the floor. Oh, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you are the oh, cutest. No. Well, thanks for the 
these great <laughs> tips. I think this you really know, will help welcome. help everyone you because know, there are so many different variations now. With I mean, and this is what we want. We want everybody together because honestly, we don't always have that kind of time to be together. Right. And so enjoying it, having fun, no matter what it is that you have. If there's mess on the table, who cares? It's being together. That's what we want to do. <laughs> and make sure to ask people too. If you're having someone new over to the house, That's you don't right. know if they have any ask food allergies. Them. And they can tell you. And if they if they want to bring their own food because that makes it easier, then it is absolutely it. fine to do that. Yeah. Just sit down, enjoy, no stress, and have a glass of wine. Be That's together. what we're going to do. Do you want to come to me? You're going to have it? Yeah. No. Oh, good. Okay. Oh, good. <laughs> for more of Leslie Fonsi's healthy living tips, watch for her here on PTL and check out her website. You'll find that link at kdka.com slash PTL. I think she would have went to Ron Smiley. He really, I think she would have. You really know, it's all about the men. That's <laughs> okay. the way that it is. <laughs>